The confectionery realm is a place of sugar, treats, and tooth cavities. But it is also a rich place of history, where each treat tells a story of innovation, taste, and cultural influence. Among the vibrant tapestry of candies, gummy worms, gummy bears, and the like stand out as iconic creations that have captured the hearts and taste buds of generations. Join us on our journey through time as we explore the fascinating history of these chewy, sweet creations from their humble beginnings to their status as beloved global treats. The story of gummy bears begins in the early 1920s in Germany. Inspired by the popularity of a dancing bear act at local festivals, Hans Reigel, the founder of the now world famous Haribo Candy Company, envisioned a chewy, bear-shaped candy that could be enjoyed by people of all ages. In 1922, Reigel introduced the world to the first gummy bear, a delightful concoction made from a mixture of gelatin, sugar, and fruit flavorings. The term gummy was derived from the gelatin used in the candy making process, which gave the bears their unique chewy texture. Prior to Han's invention, gummy candy began with the discovery and popularization of gelatin. Gelatin, derived from animal collagen, has been used for centuries to create a variety of culinary delights. Some historical recipes with gelatin have included medieval Arab cuisine, gelatinous desserts made with natural sources of gelatin, such as fish bladder or seaweed extracts, were known in medieval Arab cuisine. Nothing says dessert like fish bladder. These early desserts often featured fruit juices and sugar. In medieval and Renaissance Europe, gelatin was used in the preparation of savory dishes, particularly aspics and savory jellies. These dishes were often elaborate and showcased meats, fish, and vegetables encased in a gelled broth. In the 17th century, the term pudding in England referred to a variety of dishes that could be sweet or savory. Gelatinous substances, including isinglass, also derived from fish air bladders, were employed to create molded desserts. By the 18th century, gelatin-based desserts gained popularity in European culinary circles. Cookbooks of the time began featuring recipes for various molded desserts using gelatin, including fruit-flavored creations. However, these early gelatin desserts were still a luxury and were associated with the upper classes due to the expense and effort required to obtain and process gelatin. The widespread availability of commercial powdered gelatin in the 19th century revolutionized the use of gelatin in desserts and allowed us pores to feed upon jelly foods. This convenient form of gelatin allowed for easier preparation and contributed to the democratization of gelatin-based recipes. As a result, gelatin desserts gained widespread popularity and led to the invention of gummy candy and thus, gummy bears. Riegel's Haribo gummy bears quickly gained popularity in Germany and became a cherished treat, symbolizing both the playful spirit of childhood and the joy of indulging in a delicious snack. The popularity of gummy candies in the United States saw a significant boost with the introduction of Haribo's gummy bears in the 1980s. But before that, there were other gelatin-based candies that predated the arrival of gummy bears. And your grandmother would probably tell you how she used to buy them for a nickel. We need to go back on the gold standard. But I digress. One notable example is Chuckles, a jelly candy that has also been around since the 1920s. Chuckles were square-shaped, sugar-coated, and came in various fruit flavors. While they were not exactly the same as gummy bears, they were part of the early landscape of chewy, fruit-flavored gelatin candies in the United States. Another example is Dots, introduced by Tootsie Roll Industries in the 1940s. For those that don't know, the iconic Dots are gumdrops made with a mixture of gelatin and starch. They are chewy, come in a variety of flavors and colors, and will stick in your teeth all day. Again, not exactly gummy bears, but Dots share similarities in terms of being a chewy fruit candy. The popularity of gummy candies in the United States surged with the introduction of Haribo's gummy bears to North America. The response was overwhelming and gummy bears became a sensation, quickly securing a place among the most beloved candies in the US and remain iconic to this day. The distinctive bear shape and a variety of flavors quickly made them a beloved confection, setting the stage for the widespread availability and popularity of gummy candies in the American market. As gummy bears gained global popularity, candy manufacturers embraced the opportunity to innovate and diversify their offerings. 
Their original fruity flavors such as cherry, strawberry, orange, lemon, and raspberry were soon joined by an array of tropical and exotic tastes. Gummy bears were no longer confined to the classic teddy bear shape. They evolved to include mini bears, giant bears, and even bears with sour coatings to cater to a variety of preferences. With changing dietary trends and a growing focus on health-conscious choices, the gummy bear underwent transformations to meet the demands of an evolving consumer base. Sugar-free and low-calorie options emerged, allowing those with dietary restrictions or preference for healthier alternatives to enjoy the chewy goodness of gummy bears without compromise. But be warned, internet legend says that sugar-free gummy bears will send you to the bathroom quickly. While gummy bears had already established themselves as a global sensation, it wasn't long before the world of gummies saw the emergence of another iconic shape, the gummy worm. The exact origins of gummy worms are a bit more elusive compared to gummy bears, but they likely trace back to the creative minds of candy manufacturers seeking to expand their gummy offerings. One of these most famous and established gummy makers, aside from Haribo, is Trolley. Trolley was founded in 1975, likely trying to imitate Haribo's success. The company also originated in Germany and has since become synonymous with innovative and playful gummy creations. Trolley is recognized for introducing a variety of gummy shapes and flavors, including their iconic gummy worms. The founder of Trolley, Herbert Metterer, aimed to bring a fresh and creative approach to the gummy candy market. Over the years, Trolley has expanded its product line to include a wide range of gummy shapes and flavors, earning a reputation for whimsical and imaginative candies. The worm shape introduced a playful and slightly whimsical element to the gummy world, capturing the imagination of consumers and adding a delightful twist to the chewy candy experience. Gummy worms quickly became a staple in popular culture, making appearances in movies, television shows, and even literature. Their distinctive shape and vibrant colors made them not only a treat for the taste buds, but also a visual delight. Perfect for adding a touch of whimsy to various creative endeavors. One of the peak seasons for gummy worms is undoubtedly Halloween. The candy's worm-like appearance lends itself perfectly to spooky and playful themes, making it a favorite inclusion in trick-or-treat bags and Halloween-themed parties. The versatility of gummy worms in creating eerie scenes like being embedded in dirt made of crushed cookies has contributed to their status as a Halloween classic. As the demand for gummy candies continued to soar, artisanal and gourmet gummies entered the scene. Small batch producers and boutique candy shops began experimenting with premium ingredients and unique flavor combinations, elevating gummy bears and worms to a level of sophistication that appealed to discerning palates. To keep the excitement alive, gummy manufacturers explored collaborations with other brands and pop culture phenomena. Limited edition gummy bears and worms featuring special flavors, packaging, or tie-ins with popular movies and characters became coveted collector's items, fueling the enthusiasm of candy enthusiasts. At the heart of both gummy bears and gummy worms lies the magic of gelatin. This versatile ingredient derived from animal collagen provides the elasticity and chewiness that make gummies so irresistible. The gelatin is mixed with sugar, flavorings, and other ingredients creating a malleable mixture that can be molded into the distinctive shapes we associate with gummy candies. In response to the growing demand for plant-based options, some manufacturers have explored vegan and gelatin-free alternatives. Ingredients like pectin, agar-agar, or carotenin serve as substitutes for traditional gelatin, allowing those with dietary restrictions or ethical considerations to enjoy the chewy goodness of gummies. The popularity of gummy bears and worms extends far beyond their countries of origin. These chewy treats have become international ambassadors of sweetness, delighting taste buds in countries around the world. Local variations and adaptations have emerged, reflecting regional preferences and flavor profiles. Despite their widespread popularity, gummy bears and worms have not been without their share of controversies. The high sugar content of traditional gummies has raised concerns about their impact on dental health and overall well-being. Manufacturers have responded by introducing sugar-free and low-sugar options, but the debate over the nutritional value of these treats persists. In conclusion, the history of gummy bears and gummy worms is a rich tapestry woven with threads of creativity, innovation, and the universal love for sweet indulgence. 
From their modest beginnings in Germany to their status as global icons, these chewy wonders have evolved with the times, adapting to changing tastes, dietary preferences, and cultural trends. As gummy bears and worms continue to captivate generations and inspire new variations, one thing remains unchanged. The sheer joy that comes from sinking your teeth into a squishy, flavorful gummy. Whether you're a fan of the classic teddy bear or prefer the playful wiggle of a gummy worm, these candies have proven to be a delight for all generations to enjoy.